All right, let's get started. So we've got our Mom Papal's mix for bread pudding with the rum sauce. And this is what we're gonna start with. We have, I've got more or less everything laid out already. I've got uh, my milk, got some melted butter, and I've also got French bread. So we'll have white chocolate plus rum sauce plus the bread pudding. So it should be really good. All right, so first things first, let's get started. We'll mix in our ingredients. And this is the, the mix, pretty intense. So we'll add that in. Now I've also, I've already preheated or begun the preheating process for my oven, 350. All right, some butter goes in. This is melted six tablespoons of butter. And then three cups of milk. We only use whole milk here. None of that skim milk crap. The instructions are quite clear here. It says you mix everything uh, and then you just, uh, you whisk it all together. The mixture should be moist, but not soupy. So let's go ahead and get that started. Mix all this together first. All right, that looks good. So this is my idea of folding in. There we are. So now we just start folding this in. One of the variations I've seen is you kind of get this all mixed together and then you let it sit for as much as five hours. I've seen five hours in the fridge, but we're just gonna keep getting it so all these guys are nice and coated. And then probably what I'll do is whatever's left over, I'll just pour that into the dish as well. Looking good, nice and coated. So I tell you what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this kind of soak up for a little bit. Try and soak up as much of that mixture, maybe 15, 20 minutes. And then I'll transfer that into the pan and we'll get it in. Now, what I'm gonna do, I've got some white chocolate chips here. Now it says to fold it into the mixture. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm also gonna create a white chocolate sauce. And I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop it in. So this is what it looks like before it goes into the oven. It is dense for sure. All right, there she goes. All right, now that the bread pudding is in the oven, got about an hour and 15 minutes. A few moments later. The bread pudding is actually cooking very nicely, so it's, almost done, it's almost ready. So I'm gonna get the praline sauce going. And I'm also gonna do the white chocolate sauce all at once. So let me first start. I've got two pots here. So this is the rum sauce mixture. And now we're gonna set that to a medium heat and mix this all together. And the white chocolate sauce is actually, it's pretty straightforward. It will be Heavy cream, put the white chocolate chips, the remainder of my white chocolate chips, which is about six ounces or so. And then I'm going to add the butter in and get that all nice and thickened. This reminds me a lot of the praline mixture. So once this guy starts to boil, I'll pull that off of the heat. I'll add in my butter. I'll add in my white chocolate chips and then mix that all together. All right, let's take a look and see what we see. Can you see that? Oh yeah, nice and good. Okay, that's about ready. Pretty soon here. All right, so we're starting to get a little bit of a boil here. So that should be good to go. Mm. Oh yeah, that is definitely a rum sauce. So we're gonna bring it to a boil and then reduce the temperature. So this should, the timing should actually work out really well. We should have everything kind of coming together at the right moment. Okay, we're boiling now, so we're gonna 
bring it down. I'm going to remove it from the heat for a little bit. And I'm going to set that timer for five minutes. There we go. So you can't quite see that, but you can only hear. You can see the mixture here. This is what it looks like. The electric induction tops, it tends to hold its heat really well, even if I turn off the heat. So I'm going to let that cool down just a tad and then I'll put it back on there. And this is coming up to boil. So let's go ahead and pull that bread pudding out of the oven. There you go. Well, that's a little bit. See that right there? That looks mighty fine. All right, I'm gonna put this here. See if I can pan over a little bit. That looks good. So we've got some boiling action going on here, which is good. Okay, so now we're gonna add the butter and the chocolate. I'm gonna remove from heat. I don't see it. Let's go over here. Just don't want it right on that induction top. Add our butter in. So again, this is heavy cream. Uh, I'm using unsalted butter, just two tablespoons of unsalted butter, and then about six to eight ounces of white chocolate chips. See, it's nice and smooth. Oh, that's looking good. The butter has totally melted, so is the chocolate. Okay, that's five minutes for this guy. So the rum sauce is done, and the white chocolate sauce has got to make sure everything is mixed up. All right, as I mentioned, this is our thermometer. This is an instant read thermometer. And we are reading, I would say that's sufficient. 195, can you see that here? 200, let's go ahead and cut this guy. Now, typically, since I buttered this, it should just Slice up real nice. Right. Look at that. Oh man. Look at that. That is some yummy looking stuff right there. Alright, so now let's drizzle on our rum sauce. And our white chocolate. Yeah. Okay. Now comes the fun part, the taste test. More moments later. Okay, general consensus, right on. That's good, I'm happy with that. First time out the gate, first time, first time I made bread pudding and turned out all right.